shout out to Nadula for sponsoring today's video. I never tried the little bow trend, so I put it in and it was so cute. So I just stuck them in there. They're super easy, super cute, and they make the look very playful. So that was it. Make sure you guys check out the description box. I will leave everything down below, all links, all coupon codes, all, all that good stuff for you guys to shop with Nadula here. I really do enjoy this company, and I've been working with them for years, and it's been very consistent for me, okay? The quality mwah, is there every time. So today I have this um, kinky straight unit. It's like one of those glueless units, so you can either lay it down with some glue, some spray, whatever you prefer, or you could just pop it on and go. So this is how the wig looks straight out the box. It is more of a side part, but you know, for this this, I wasn't really feeling that so I went ahead and parted my hair down the middle I just want a nice like blowout type of look and I love that this kinky wig actually had the kinky tech the kinky texture the kinky edges because it made it look more realistic as well again this is straight out the box I did not pluck anything I did not bleach anything I literally applied the wig added some like powder to the part and all that which it was a little too light, but once I did my makeup, I got it together and um, I straightened it and that was pretty much it, you guys. This install was super easy. I was like procrastinating doing my hair all day and when I finally sat down, I was like, wow, I could have done that mm, hours ago because it took no more than 30 minutes. So this is the wig up close, getting to the quality, the detail, like the hairline just looks so good and so, so, so natural. So I really, really love that. Um, I did hot comb the edges though but it still gave natural i've been liking just like either my natural hairline or my hairline to be as natural as possible the silky straight is just not for me so oh i, I guess it depends but with straight hair i've told you guys time and time again for straight a bust down moment i personally prefer a kinky texture a yaki texture something of that sort with a little bit more texture and that is natural because it just looks better on me i feel like when the hair is too silky and it's straight it really does give like wig or it gives um it just gives like witch like i don't know i can't explain it but if you know you know so i'm very lazy when it comes to flat ironing my hair so i literally sprayed it with some kind of like heat serum whatever and i just um and flat ironing the hair and it did give it a nice little a little luster baby so you guys are going to see the difference from this side to the other side it wasn't like a huge huge difference but it definitely got silky and i only did one pass so i love that i didn't have to like do too much and i feel like because of the texture you don't have to make sure your hair is perfectly straight like it could have a little kink to it and it's not a problem so you guys see the movement it's a little bit different but it's not too too silky so love that Now that the hair is straight, I'm just doing a little tweaking and I'm making sure it's laying how I want and I'm gonna add a little bit of powder to the lace and to the part because also I did not cut the lace as well. You can cut it to your likings, but I didn't. I said at the beginning of the video that the lace, I mean that the powder was a little bit too light, but once I did my makeup and all that, it came together so don't worry about that. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much all I had to do and then this time I actually sprayed the spray under my lace because I wanted to be able to take it on and off. I didn't want to commit to like a real install today, you feel me? It's summer, it's hot, and nobody has the time. I wanted this to be as easy as possible. So whenever I'm doing like my quote unquote glueless um, methods and not so like intense, which I don't use glue anyway, but if you know, you know, um, I like to just spray underneath, put a band on, and that's it. So I'm just making sure my hair is nice and laid. Whenever I wear straight hair, I will literally comb my hair 50 million times and um, until it's right. Even though this hair is kinky and it's low maintenance, I still want it to be laid and slayed, all right? So make sure you guys check out Nadula. I will leave all the information for this hair down below. This hair actually, you guys, is gonna be good for the summer because it is low maintenance, okay? I know we don't do straight hair in the summer, quote unquote, but if you do like the look of straight hair, I would highly recommend this. It is very full though, but it's going to be better for this weather because baby the silky straight is not going to give you that so again thanks so much for watching and i will see you guys in the next one bye